hey, hey. Good to see everybody in. How is everybody doing today? Let's see, who do we've got in? We have Effie Vader, Magnus Pull, and been watching so far, so far. Anyway, anyway, I have a question. I have a question for the Globe Earthers. So let's see if I can get this, this show on the road. Hi, Cyx Warrior. Right. So before I play this video, I mean it's a beautiful day. Let's be honest. Sun there we go. So what we have here is a video that I just took this morning. Right now, I know that I've mentioned it this this year already. Uh, good morning, Trish. Nice to see you in. Um, now, was there a question there? Ramty enjoying the egg on your face. Agreed, Vader. Simon Dan just destroyed Ramty. I don't think so. In actual fact, we have Gleam, who's going to be doing a presentation this Friday on that specific topic. I mean, I could have addressed it myself. It, it would have been probably easier for me to actually do the debunking of Simon Dan. Um, but uh, Gleam got in touch with me and said he wanted to do it, so I'm quite happy for him to do it too because it's essentially the same thing. It's just that somebody else is different. It'll be somebody else doing it rather than me. So tune in on Friday uh, for that absolutely smashing of Simon Dan. In the meantime, in the meantime, back on topic. Um, down at the beach today, um, and this has been a, a, a thing that's essentially been this all year long, is the visibility. So I'm going to play the video um, and you'll hear me talking through it. Um, and this is going to be a specific question for Globe Earthers and uh, particularly people like Simon Dan, Conspiracy Cats, um, Slice Barcane, uh, Red's Rhetoric, all that kind. Um, I want them to answer this very one specific question. Uh, Ragnar, nice to see you in. Um, Effie Vader, Simon Dan really did a number on Ranty. No, not really. I have to say, no, not really. Um, in actual fact, he embarrassed himself and it will be exposed this Friday. Never mind. Uh, Clearly, nice to see you in. Right, let's, without further ado, let's get on with this video. I mean, it's a beautiful day, let's be honest. The sun's out. The ocean's calm. Unfortunately, there's just no visibility at all. Um, over this way, we should have the uh, the Welsh mountains. Just can't see anything. So, I have a question for the Globers. See, all year long, this has been a, a a regular occurrence. Especially every time I've been down, I've just there's been just no visibility at all. So, I would like to ask the Globers a question. Right? It's the most glorious day. It's bank holiday, obviously. People are out in the shorts and t-shirt. The beach is starting to fill up. It's much more packed down at uh, the piers. Um. We have a, a nice calm water. So my question is this, seeing as we always get the same question. Things have disappeared. In this case, mountain ranges, you know, a good proportion of the wind turbines are missing. All of the Welsh mountains are missing over here, right? So tell me, why can't we see them? We should be able to see them. We should have a direct line of sight towards it. So, I'm not interested in excuses. I want to hear real answers. I want to hear real answers to this question. Why can't we see what we should be able to see? Because there is an earth curve in the way. We should have direct line of sight to this. So why can't we see the mountains over there and why can't we see the mountains over here? It's a very simple question uh, on such a beautiful day. And yeah, with that, I'll leave you guys to ponder it. And there we have it. Very simple question. Uh, let me specifically find 
a very good reference point uh, for you. There we go. So here we go. Now, I want to know where are the mountains? Why can't we see them? Um, if you live on a globe model, um, the model would suggest that you should be able to see the mountains. Um, why can't we see them? It's a beautiful day, the sun's out, people are out in the shorts and t-shirt, I believe that the temperature today was uh, 26 degrees, yeah, it said and so in the car anyway, when I was trying to find the parking space. So 26 degrees, beautiful day, people are out in the shorts and t-shirt, people are out on the speed boats, you name it. Um, where's the mountains gone? Why can't we see them? So it's a very simple question, and this is I'm directing this specifically at Conspiracy Cats and Simon Dan. It's a very, very simple question. Uh, Zana, nice to see you in. Uh, Dave Gafford, Ewan Jensen's, um, uh, Ron Hadberg, Brian Shuka, Level and Flat, Michael Kilpatrick, and Ryan Q. Vincent. So, yeah, again. Uh, I just want to know why can't we see uh, the mountains behind uh, behind here? Where where have they vanished to? Where have they gone? Why can't we see them? See, we get asked quite a lot. Why can't we see to uh, like a hundred miles away or one hundred and fifty miles away uh, at sea level, etc.? So in this particular case, we're not looking quite as far at all. Uh, we're looking much nearer than that. So it's a very simple question: Where have the mountains gone? Why can't we see them? Uh, I'm using a P1000, I'm filming in 4K, so this is 4K video footage. Um, I'm s half zoomed in, so I'm at around about a thousand zoom right now, I think. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong, I, I might be wrong on that, but in any event, I'm somewhere in that that low, that region, sort of like maybe 800 or a thousand. In any event, where have the mountains gone? Dead easy, beautiful day, sun's out. Tell me where has the mountains gone? Where, why can't we see them? Um, who else have we got in? Five Angels, nice to see you in. Um, Kin Noiden. Somebody asked me before, am I on the east coast? No, I'm actually on the west coast. Um, I'm actually on the west coast, so I'm facing the Isle of Man. So that was Ewan Jansen's. Do you live on the east coast of England? Uh, having a line of sight to Holland? No. Um, <laughs> that would be the last thing I would want is a direct line of sight to Arwen <laughs> no thank you um, Dave Gafford uh, nice to see you in optics and sky even smart men are deceived create a baby indeed yeah well we all know exactly Trish we know what the answer is but there is no way they will answer it well see Simon Dan as was quite rightly uh, pointed out before uh, did a, a video on me this week which will be addressed this Friday let me just tell you that now um, it will be addressed this Friday um, however uh, Conspiracy Cats also includes me in his videos and it's very rare that I that I'm ask them a particular question or to address something so I'm asking them to address this particular question including Red's Rhetoric or, or, or anybody really, Slice Bar Kane doesn't really matter, any globe earther out there answer me this question why can't we see the mountains that we should be able to see on such a beautiful day it's dead easy you know I mean there's there's nothing there's no trick question here it's just something that I would like an answer to and I'll tell you for why because I've been down here all all, all summertime and taking videos sometimes I've not even bothered taking the video it's just been pointless because there's been no visibility in fact, I've, it's been the, the worst year for filming that I can recall anyway. Uh, point is, where's the mountains gone? Um, who else do we have in? Um, Ali B, nice to see you in. Uh, Erwin Johnson's, uh, too bad I have a P900. It was nice to do some tests together. Well, funnily enough, uh, I've actually been in touch with, somebody actually got in touch with me, and they live towards uh, Baron Furness, so... It looks like we'll be able to get some um, some observations done um, and some testing done from that way. So that's something to look forward to in the coming weeks. Um, yeah, so again, the question is, Simon Dan, Conspiracy Cats, where behind me here, where, where are the mountains? Where have they gone? 
why can't we see them? You can do it in a video, you can leave a message, um, you can email me, uh, you can email me at ranty at rantyflatearth.com, you can leave a message on this video when it's finished uploading, you can do your own video uh, addressing why we're not seeing the mountains in this particular shot, where have the mountains gone? Uh, F.E. Vader, this proves nothing. I'm not saying it proved it. F.E. Vader, did I say it proved anything? You see, I look at conspiracy cats and Simon Dan, and, and they come across as uh, what you'd like them to believe is the, uh, the globe Earth hierarchy. You know, the ones that you can go to to answer questions. And the way they treat flat earthers is essentially... Um, with contempt uh, and they know all the answers they know all the answers and they can do, do videos all the time so I'm putting the ball in their court I'm a stupid flat earther and I want to know where these mountains have gone and conspiracy cats yes you can you can take that out clip of me going I'm a stupid flat earther and I'm sure you will and you'll use it in your videos uh, in the upcoming videos and it'll probably be a little thing that you'll just keep on using over and over and over of me saying that but hey I don't care. I just want an answer to this question. Where have the mountains gone? Uh, Ranty trying to cancel out his destruction of Simon Dan. Right, F.E. Vader, do you know what? I have addressed this like three times. Um, do you know what? I'm going to put you in a timeout just because I can't be bothered seeing your questions anymore. Um, right, so this is the question. Where have the mountains gone? Is there any Globers in the chat right now? We have 61 people and they can't all be Flat Earthers that are, are watching this stream. So, uh, there must be some Globe Earthers in here right now. So, if there's a Globe Earther in, um, can you tell me? Where have these gone? Where, where have the mountains gone? Um, Brian Shuker, you could go to Southport see if I could see you, Ramsey. That would be excellent. I've been to Southport a few times this year um, and you can actually see uh, the wind turbines very clearly you know, over in the distance. In fact, you can see far more of the turbines than you should do, the ones at Ormond and etc. Um, so it's probably reasonable you'd expect to see me near the, near the mirror ball or something like that, if you've got a line of sight, that is. Um, they won't answer you simply because you won't accept the truth. I will accept the truth. I want to know what the truth... I will accept the truth. If they can tell me the truth and tell me where these mountains have gone. Why can't we see them? That's what I want to know. I want it documented why we can't see these building, uh, these um, mountains right now. Uh, Ragnar, okay, Ragnar, you're a Glober, right, okay. Ragnar, can you tell me why can't we see these mountains, please? <laughs> yeah, Photoshop, Photoshop tucks them away. Magnets pull. Uh, good, good timed out. Um, you're a liar. Remember when you said you got attacked by a globe one? Why is that a lie? I have no idea why you would suggest that was a lie. Um, right, so. Invite Jamie Brown. He is almost a globe earther now, and you might be able to answer. I've met John, Jamie Brown. Tall lad. Um, yeah, I think he's finding his own way, you know, he's, he's obviously in with the Globers, so, yeah, it's just one of them, isn't it? Um, right, Michael Kilpatrick, it'll be another theory, um, you can bet, yeah, it probably will, it'll probably need some mathematics or something like that, but I'm, I'm a simple fella, I just want a simple answer, I just want to, I just want, I want these, uh, Simon Dan and conspiracy cats to uh, to tell me where where the mountains have gone. You know, on their globe model, we should have line of sight to them. Um, you know, where where are they? Why will Ranty put his face out there? And those globers are camera shy, indeed. Well, it's may it's not all the globers are camera shy, but um, most of the the trolls are. Um, Jamie is a good fellow, he's doing well. It was a bit dodgy with the fasting for a while. I, I haven't followed him for a while, to be fair, so I've not really followed his journey. 
Um, but I did see when he actually flipped from being a, a, a flat earther to uh, to sort of like in between. So I saw that time, um, and I've not really followed him since then. Ah, here we go. Ragnar Stefan Hollandson. Right, just bad visibility, Ranty. They are there still. Now that's called an honest glow birther, that. That is an honest glow birther. Uh, now, I would like uh, Simon Dan, Conspiracy Cats, to perhaps give the same answer. If that's, if that's what the globe answer is, um, as to why we can't see these mountains, uh, that it's just bad visibility, even though it's a glorious day, even though it's an absolutely beautiful day, I mean, just look at, just let me just play some of this video, I'll put it on mute. But even, even though it's an absolutely glorious day, the sun's out, 26 degrees, we've got blue skies, blue sea, um, people are out in the shorts and the t-shirt, but it's just bad visibility. I thought you only got bad visibility on overcast, shadowy, rainy days. Well, why haven't we got bad visibility on a day like this, on a day where it's absolutely glorious? where the golden sands are really golden in 26 degree temperatures and blue seas, blue skies, you know, people in shorts and t-shirts. Why, why is there bad visibility on this day? Why can't we see it? Hmm? What's the question? <laughs> Lottie, 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 Lottie. Right, over here. You're a you're a Welshman. I'm pretty sure you're a Welsh fella, right? So being that you live over in Wales and we should be able to see the mountains of Wales from uh, from Blackpool, why can't we see the mountains today, Lottie? Why can't we see the mountains? Why are they not there on a beautiful day like this? Hmm. Why can't we, why can't we, it's, it's a very simple question. I'm not asking any flat earth proof. I'm not asking any globe earth proof. I'm not asking for anything other than why can't we see the mountains uh, that we should be able to see on either model. Either it's flat and we just have clear line of sight anyway, or it's globe and you know, some of them should be hidden, but the majority should still be visible. So why can't we see them, um, Lottie? Why can't we see these these Welsh mountains over here? Where have they gone? Why is my 4K P1000 not picking up uh, these mountains over here? Where have they gone? Why, why haven't? Why can't we see them? In fact, why can't we even see uh, Liverpool? You know, Liverpool's over this way. Why can't we even see Liverpool? And where is it? Where's the, where's these mountains gone? Where where is everything? Simple question. No flat. No tricks. No flat earth proof. No globe earth proof. Just want a simple question. Where have they gone? Ranty, thanks. F thank you for providing the proving the globe over and over. If you think so, I'm just asking questions. <laughs> Lottie, they melted. It's too hot. It's it's a warm day. I'll give you that. It is 26 degrees. Um, but hey, look how look how calm the water is. I mean, there's barely a ripple on the water. Uh, we've got the guys out in the jet skis, we've got people swimming, we've got people in the shorts and t-shirt, 26 degrees, it is glorious. Blue skies, where's the mountains? Why, why can't we see the mountains? Well, you know, I thought we couldn't see far on just rainy and horrible and overcast and crappy days, you know. Where, where's the mountains gone? I mean, they're big enough to see. Too away for eyesight, too far away for eye. No, no, not at all. You can see them with your eye. Um, I've seen them dozens of times. Um, I filmed them dozens of times, but the simple point is, where is it today? Uh, Flat Shandy, I like this Ranty, good job, thank you very much. Indeed, it's just a simple question, where have the mountains gone? I'm not, I'm not asking for anything other than just a simple answer. So Simon Dan, Conspiracy Cats, uh, Red Rhetoric, address it please. We've had one Globe Earther say that it's just Poor visibility. Um, I just, I, I don't, I, I can't say that for sure. It looks like it looks to me like there's blue skies, blue skies, twenty six degrees. Um, why are we getting poor visibility? If that's the case, is that the answer? Is that the answer? Poor visibility. If that's the answer, tell me. You know, you guys are smart. You guys know what you're talking about. So tell us, tell us what's the, you know, 
What's the answer here? <clears throat> the mountains crumbled into the sea, but there will always be you and me. <laughs> uh, Gary Baxter. Suzanne Dawson. Earth warped into a curve because of the heat. Yeah, that's another possibility. It's another possibility. Maybe it's... Um, I don't know. Maybe there's a mathematical formula for why we can't see these uh, these mountains. I just want an answer. See, on the globe model, and I'm going to say this as a you know a model, a model. On the globe model, we have a ball. Just a ball. Okay. Now let's see if I can get the model up. Let's see if we can find Google Earth. Let's see if we can get Google Earth up. Let's have a look at their model. Here we go. So, here's their model. Here is their model, right? So, if I if I go down here, and I go down here, I can just see stuff. I mean, I am, if I'm on their model, uh, how high would I be here? Let's see. So, I, I altitude, what does that say? 631 kilometers. So, so I'm 631 kilometers up here right now, and I can't even see, I can't even see from the mirror ball over here. I can't even see the Welsh mountains over here. I can't even see that distance. I mean, I can't even see that far. What's going on? Let's just put a line in there and just get an idea. 57 miles away. I can't see these mountains over here. Where, where have they gone? Yeah, I'm a yeah yeah on this model. On this model, I can see I can see everything. Hang on, let's see how far I can see on this model, right? So I'm going to lift Google Earth up. <laughs> wow, look how far I can see here, right? On this model, on this model, look, right, here we go. Let's do a measurement. So uh, let's get underneath me. So where's underneath me? So let's say there, that looks like it's underneath me. Uh, and let's see how far we can see on this model, right? Let's see how far we can see on this model. Right, so over on this model, we can see for 934 miles on this model. This model says we can see for 934 miles. So, if I, I just don't understand it. This model says that we can see this far, but reality says that we can't see this far. Well, what's going on? You know, I... I I just don't understand it. It's, it's we both got similar days. Look how look at look. It looks quite so well, somewhat sunny and bright on, on this model. Well, it's sunny and bright on this model, uh, and uh, yeah, but it was sunny and bright today. But you know, we're not seeing anything. We're not seeing very far at all. Where's the mountains gone? Why why aren't we seeing this? It's very. Very strange set of circumstances, wouldn't you think? You know, as a flat earther, I think it's my right to ask the globe earthers for their opinion on this. You know, why can why can the model say that we can see that far, but reality says that we can't, even on the best days possible? Right, Fantarang, you're all over it. Give Ranty your answer again, Fantarang. Ranty, why can't you answer this yourself? Is that the question? Um, is that your answer? The Earth curves, so naturally stuff will be falling behind the curve. Okay. Uh, or also we'd see the sun 24-7 all over Earth. Really? Is that what you think? Trish, indeed I have the answer. I want, I want the glo I, I just want the globe Earthers to answer this, though. I'm not... I, you know, I don't want to be the one saying that I know the answer or suspect what the answer is. Um, I just want the, the Globers to address this. Where, where's the mountains gone, you know? Dead simple. Conspiracy cat, Simon Dan, I'm going to ask you again. Red's rhetoric, Sly Sparkane. Where's these mountains? Where have they gone? Where are they? Why can't we see them on a glorious day? Your model says we should be able to see it. Let's see if I can get down low enough to, to actually make that point. Uh, let's see how good your model actually is. Because your model says that I should see them. 
So let's find where I was. Uh, here we go, Mirabel, Mirabel. It's got to be down here. There's that Mirabel. So there's the Mirabel. And I was just here. So I was down here. So let me get as low down as I can without it actually turning into street view. And let's see if I can see the mountains. If I look over here. Ah, look at this. Look at this. There's the mountains. Look, here we go. On this model, this model says that I can see the mountains. Look, I can see the mountains over here. In fact, I can see all this land all the way over here. I've got these mountain ranges over here from my exact location. So Google Earth says that I should be able to see these mountains, and I just don't understand why we can't see them. So this is what Google Earth shows, uh, and and this is what reality shows. So, so yeah, simple as that. Roger M C. Weather report says visibility is ten kilometers. Well, I would, I don't know whether to say that's good or bad because. Um, why is that not included in the globe model? Why is that not included in um, when people, globe earthers say, how come you can't see uh, straight across um, 500 miles of, of lake or 500 miles of ocean to go and see uh, a distant shoreline? Why is that not included in that then? Why is visibility not taken into account? a genuine question model says we should see it reality says we don't anyway that's pretty much all I've got to say um, what time is it now so I've been going for nearly half an hour which is cool um, <laughs> the uh, the missus uh, just dropped her her uh, phone down the toilet for the third time literally for the third time not the same phone she's had to get a new phone every time so she's just dropped her uh, phone down the, the toilet. She's got it in some rice right now. Uh, I couldn't help but laugh. Um, but yeah, we're about to uh, to head on out, uh, going out for the day. So I'm gonna enjoy myself, have a, a day off flat earth apart from this. And in the meantime, the question's gonna be out there. Uh, where's the mountains gone? Conspiracy cat, Simon Dan. I would just like an answer. Um, very simple, uh, RC, who is he? Who said, where has he gone now? Says the visibility is only 10 kilometers today. Uh, Roger MC, weather report says visibility is 10 kilometers, right? So what does that mean? Tell me, what, what what's included in this visibility report? In fact, when do we ever get a visibility report that says we can see for infinity? Um, very simple question. Because if, if that's what you're gonna rely on, uh, a visibility, visibility report that says 10 kilometers where's the visibility report that says you can just see forever and ever and ever uh right uh oh time for our win bet he'll be showing his nipples for super chats today oh dearie me yeah he, he definitely will have his nipples out i, I would imagine um, um yeah that's all i'm gonna say about that right guys uh yeah our win starts in 15 minutes uh, I'm going to round up and I'll see you all in the next one.